Davis. Ten minutes ago, a bunch of protesters started smashing this police car, flipped it over onto its top, and then they uh, were trying to set it on fire after bashing it, breaking into windows, hitting it with skateboards. There's a lot of people doing this. Um, there was another group saying, don't do this. We don't want to do this. Oh, my God. 
goes out to the four brothers who come. We're almost there. Okay, so everybody started running away from the car because they're trying to light it on fire and they were thinking it was going to explode. But they're still here, hitting the car, bashing it. Everybody was really worried that at some point we were going to have violence or attacking on the property. Again, I'm not seeing people getting injured per se, but this is definitely the uh, biggest aggression I've seen in the three, four hours that, uh, that I've been here. There was some graffiti on the public safety building. But now they got this uh, Salt Lake City police car. Flipped it onto its side, then onto its roof. And they're completely just bashing it with anything they can find. Yeah, this is starting to get a little out of control here. We are at 2nd East and 4th South. We're just outside the city library here. Uh, we did see a heavy police presence come out this way earlier. Uh, the crowd followed them from the public safety building to get out here to the library. It was the first time they'd really seen a police presence out in this area. And then this one Salt Lake City police car was just parked on the side of the road. And these protesters, ralliers, took advantage of the situation. And they are still... They are still trying to bash that police car.
shouldn't have brought his ass over there then. They're trying to light that uh, police car there on fire. So uh, it's getting a little out of hand. So we're gonna move back a little bit over here and um, regroup here. And yeah, it's definitely starting to get out of hand here in Salt Lake City. A lot of angry people. Okay, we'll, uh, we'll gather up. We've been doing some interviews and chatting with some folks, and we'll, we'll wrap it up and get that on our newscasts coming up here on KSL 5 later today. Okay. It's not a good day for Salt Lake. Not when it turns violent like this. I, protesting is a right. You can do that. But destroying this type of property, I don't know. I don't know. Okay. Be safe, everyone.